Alright, what's poppin'? I like Cadi tips here, so today we're gonna be talking about something real important like when your Ducati doesn't turn on. So we have to learn how to diagnose certain things like it, it could be the starter, it could be the starter relay, it could be the battery, it could be the the coils, um, it could be the alternator or the stator, it could be the sprag clutch. So First of all, we have to learn those fundamentals, but we're not speaking on that today. Today, what I'm speaking about specifically is the starter and how to get information, how to find parts numbers. I, I don't really get into too much of the repairs. I just get into like trying to get in depth into finding information by yourself and just being savvy and looking up your own shit. So watch the whole video and I uh, hope you guys enjoy. All right, so we're going to start it off right here. I'm going to take my highlighter tool and we're going to highlight the starter which is this one right here so that's number one first we have to find the parts number so the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go on this list right here and I'm gonna look up parts number I already have them pre highlighted because these are some things that I'm, I'm trying to get for my own motorcycle just in the future so I'm talking about it so we see that parts number there I'm gonna go into this other page where I had my channel posted I'm gonna open up a new window and I'm going to type in those numbers that I see right there. So it's 207. All right. No, my bad. 270. 401. 27. And an A. So let's just type that in. All right. So automatically I'm getting different links to that parts number on eBay. There's one going for 127, 187. And then look, specific Ducati parts. The reason I, I show people to look up parts and stuff like this is because this isn't really spoke about in like the Ducati circle. You usually just go to the, like the dealer and the dealer charge you a lot of money. Then you pay all that money and you walk away with a fixed bike. I'm, I'm real into like DIY and learning how to do things myself. So this is like super important. Always have the parts catalog and then the workshop manual now we're gonna get into the workshop manual and if I go right here in the workshop manual and I put starter that's all I have to put all I have to put is starter is it gonna look up anything in this PDF I view permissions and contact copy and I bet All right, and it's gonna have and it's gonna show us anything having to do with like starting but just to make it simple let's just go into the electrical chassis and we can start finding things on ourselves but I don't know why it didn't show me anything when I put up okay now we're getting into it so now it's directing us into the wiring of the starter motor. We're in this catalog. This is a starter motor right here, but it's just showing us what wires are connected to what. And that's actually pretty important, but I'm going to go back to the table of context in general. And now we're getting into the good stuff. All right, we're getting a little sidetracked, but you see these are battery housings. This... um. How, how do I explain it? If you see on this right hand side, anything that's red, that's highlighted, is, is because it's speaking about starting or electron, el, el, electric starting of any type of things. Anything having to do with the starter motor is going to get highlighted on your track bar. So just remember that shit. I'm not a good speaker and these are like my, my like coming up videos. But remember, keep this shit on tap. LA Cotter here with the tips. Like, comment, and subscribe. If you subscribe, bro. I'll give you an imaginary dollar, I swear to God. All right, so let's get back into it. So now that we know what part we're looking for, let's say the part, we already got the part, we have to get somewhere in range between all these videos. You can go and download this PDF, which is the Ducati Monster 821 Workshop Manual for the year 2015, and trust, you'll be set. With this workshop manual alone, you'll know how to take everything apart and put everything back together, like according to Ducati specifications. And then this is called the parts catalog. With the parts catalog, 
it's you're just gonna be able to access everything you know like all the all the codes that you need to look up parts and make it so easy on yourself so yeah uh keep watching my videos i was here just explaining that but if you guys are interested in more videos let me know Deuce.